hi techy guys i'm nand kishor swami and in this particular tutorial we would be just putting all the things together so let's get started so to play or uh, to enable our computer to play the game uh, we would be using a particular flow and that flow is something like uh, once customer comes in we'll first check if customer makes an order that would be based on the what sushi they are ordering so we'll capture that particular uh, sushi order area then based on that order area we will create uh, uh, we have another function which will capture the image and just get the grayscale values and then we'll have a sum and based on the sum we have already created another um, a dictionary key pair value variable uh, that will help us to recognize what particular sushi customer is ordering so that's here so we'll have this value and based on this value we have um, a dictionary key pair value um, uh, variable and from that variable we'll get the sushi type the customer has order so once we recognize what customer is ordering we'll uh, start cooking the food and we'll start making the food and at the at the time making the food if we recognize the, we are running low at any of the ingredient then we'll buy the ingredients and once that is done we'll also clear the table and then repeat the same thing so how do we do it let's uh, declare a variable s1 that would be denoting like seat one and get the seat ones sum of the grayscale area which would be the sushi area so once we get the sum we'll check if that sum is available so how we will get the sum that is here so we pass a, a top left uh, corner a value of sushi and the bottom right corner of the sushi then we'll convert or get the sum of grayscale area then we'll check if that sum value is available in the dictionary key pair value variable which is here if that is available it means customer has ordered something which is uh, known or uh, in our recipe if it is then we'll start making the food if it's not then sushi not found our customer is not available or might be available but ordering something different which is uh, not in our recipe so this is the flow that we're going to use and similarly we'll repeat the same thing for all other six seats so you can see just copy and paste the uh, seat uh, one's value on the C2, C3, C4, 5 and 6. So this would be the same flow for all 6 seats. So once we are done serving on all 6 seats, we'll clear the table and once we uh, clear the table, we'll check if, the, if we need to order the food. If any ingredient needs to be ordered, if we are running out of the ingredient and how do we check if we are running out of the ingredient we have another function which is a kind of for loop which will loop through each ingredient which is the value of i and if it is matching of any of these and the value is like the uh, remaining item on uh, is less than four then we'll order or buy that particular ingredient so that's the logic so that's the final logic and in the next tutorial we would be finalizing our code and enabling our uh, robot to play the game thanks for watching see you in next tutorial